guys today is my day six um, working in a row and I cannot wait for tomorrow I just I like I love my job most of the time <laughs> to say that <laughs> but not when I work six days straight it's just too much it's too much <laughs> but let's go let's do it because it will dye your skin 
and then it looks kind of weird so i don't have much hair guys so for me it's super easy to do this it will look like a mess as a child i used to dye hair of my mom so i have experiences guys <laughs> child till my 20s just make sure you like really massage the dye to the roots especially where you have where you do like your splits because that could look very very bad doing this because I'm getting gray hair. I dye my hair about three times a year perhaps as well the sun literally eats the color out of my hair. So yeah. This is not so bad. See? So I have this crazy looking thing on my head right now. I'm taking my gloves off this way because I will reuse them in about 10 minutes actually 20 minutes now I need towels to remove all this mapping there now I look like Morticia because I'm so pale guys we just came home from dinner I just wore super simple dress I think this is from Alexander Wang or something like that and I like it, it's comfortable, but it's very hard to put on over your shoulders because this part here is so freaking tight. You see now you can see the ruffles and stuff. I got some deliveries today. This is going back, that doesn't fit. Guys, Lola tampons, are you using natural tampons without, um, how you call it, without chemicals? Very important, just to let you know, ladies, very important. I've been using Lola for like six years now. I got dry shampoo from IGK and I got like the samples from Sephora because I have so many points. So I got drunk elephant vitamin C. I got my favorite deodorant. Oh, this is supposed to be eucalyptus. Yes, it is. What is this? Murad acne control. Orbe texturizing spray, I love that one. And this little box from Sunday, Beauty Insider, of course. I love that. Let me show you. Oh, this is a madness. So this is what I got. These are some cute little things to try. I really like it. I actually have to say this company is quite good. And I got hats, so I've been planning to buy a sun hat for the beach, but sometimes I just take it a little too boring, so I like to wear like baseball hats. This is New York with roses. This is just New York Yan Yankees, right? I think that's what it is. Just classic beige, and this is LA. So yeah, that's my sun hats to protect my face. Even now I see the way the light goes. That's how I get sun damage on my cheeks. Guys, I am so tired. We came super late last night. We went to movie theater after my work and we saw Cruella. Have you seen the movie yet? It was fabulous. First I was just like, I don't care for this movie, but that was so much fun. I really enjoy it. The fashion, by the way, was unbelievable. The story was amazing. The music was fabulous. I loved it. Actually, my husband enjoyed it too. So it was cool. And I was surprised <laughs> how packed the movie theater was, especially on Sunday, Saturday night, because this is Miami. People party on Saturdays. Everything is open, clubs are open. People go to party here <laughs> from all around the world. But not the movie theater was busiest from ever. Like I have never seen it this busy, it was crazy. And it's a large movie theater. It has like 120 seats in one room. <laughs> I woke up today at 7 a.m. <laughs> Even I went to bed at like 1 a.m. So I'm not very fresh looking 
but I'm going to fix it up. <laughs> I needed to work out. I took, I think, three days break from fitness. I don't know why, I should never done that. Because working out makes me happy. I don't understand how some people never work out, honestly. It just like makes me happy. Morning with coffee. That is just my have. I am always like a little bitchy <laughs> till I drink my coffee. I don't know, I wasn't like that before, but I guess with age things change, right? Coffee is so good, especially with the oat milk, I love it. This is just really sad situation and I need something to really last. So this is it. This lasts forever. I'm not going to lie, I'm loving my hair super black. It's so much better. Guys, I purchased this to see if this is gonna work. It's a color down your brown. And this is for Ash Brown from uh, Christoph Robin. I used it once. I thought it was like conditioner because I didn't read the direction. Smart. And this is something what you should actually use like here and there, not every day. So I have to buy a new conditioner. But anyway, it's supposed to like make the color stay and not to become like resin, more red, but stay cool tone. And I like that. So, so how this works? Uh, okay, so I think this is for the other side. I'm gonna do it my way. Not much. <laughs> so talented. So talented. Okay, there is a little bit of, uh, you know what I mean, structure. Can you sit on a video? Yes, boss. <laughs>
so today was such a nice day off i work out in the morning even for brunch we did this van gogh thing which was absolutely fantastic and before we went to the van gogh we stopped by a store and i got something for myself it was absolutely unplanned but i've been thinking about it for a long time so let me show you what i got my bag just fell very good so what is it it's so tiny okay but i got this bag is very hard to open so i've been planning to get this one for a really long time because i wanted to have it crossbody it's so tiny though i was not expecting it to be so tiny oh, and it's so pretty so yeah i've been lately stressed a little bit so i decided to treat myself i actually purchased shoes from bottega but i purchased a uh, half size too small i purchased my size which is eight and a half and i needed size nine because it's like this strappy sandal and when you put the your toes there it has like the thing in between and it doesn't allow you to fully slide and that kind of didn't work for me so i needed half size bigger so i had to return the shoes and now i'm waiting for bottega to receive my size because they're completely sold out i could buy it on like my teresa or forward or Luzan via roma or neto porte but i kind of feel I will support the Miami market, so that's what I kind of decide. Why not? If I want something, I can sometimes go to the store and buy it, right? Even I do enjoy shopping online. What do you guys prefer? Do you enjoy shopping online or do you like to go to the store? So I love shopping online. I love it, I love it, I love it. But very often I have to exchange things or return things because they don't fit or you are disappointed by the fabrics. And sometimes you have issues with the companies because they don't always want you to do that, right? Which is a complication. But as well, I enjoy guys just to taking stroll around, you know, the shopping area when you're holding your shopping bag and you just like go for a cocktail after because you just treated yourself very well. And that was my day today and I'm so in love. I was not expecting to buy today. I was actually waiting for like the holidays. <laughs> I told my husband, I'm like, I want it for the holidays. But you were there. So cute. Do you like it? It's tiny, yes. It's a very classic piece and the leather is so cute oh, anyway guys i'm going to wash my face from all this makeup which is actually not that much as you know i don't put that much makeup on but i definitely am loving the bronzer from uh, westman atelier as eyeshadow guys i'm loving it if you're looking for bronzer I highly recommend you to go for it and the blush from her is absolutely fantastic those are my two products which i will definitely repurchase you know i don't really buy foundations and the stick foundation can be a problem i like it very much but i will have it for a very long time so i have all my foundations for a really long time after a while i have to just throw them away because i don't really use them i usually use just like the concealers you know under my eye area and to cover up issues that's all so let's take this face off and I may put mask on because I feel like I'm blurry. Do you think I'm blurry? Yeah. <laughs> I think I will put mask on because why not? Tomorrow is a Monday. It's a Memorial Week. Memorial Day. It's a holiday. So I go to work till but I work 11 to 6. So that's like a Sunday hour. Holiday hour. Loving it. Fabulous. So it will be short day and I'll prepare some lunch actually for tomorrow. I cook some pasta with the veggies, which you could see. A lot of fiber. I'm very focused on fiber right now. Guys, I'm going to get myself in the best shape ever. And yes, it's okay to have a little bit of pasta. You need a little bit of carbs. It depends what you eat before and after, you know, and what time. For me, the best way to get in shape is not to eat at night. Like after five, six o'clock, if I don't eat, things happen <laughs> and it's good thing. <laughs> but I love food, so it's a struggle for me, but that's life. <laughs> okay, let's wash this face. My battery died, of course. Let's wash this. 
so my screen has been washed off my face my skin feels nicely clean i still have some kind of bumps going on i don't need facial guys i need hydrofacial i need got them hydrofacial it's so hard in miami to get facial these days i don't know what's going on can all the new yorkers can all the new yorkers go back home <laughs> it's like they're taking over the city <laughs> i love my new yorkers they're so funny honest and realistic and to the point you know no nonsense at least the ones i have met <laughs> so i really appreciate them but restaurants are fully booked you cannot go anywhere you have to do reservations days ahead or weeks and the traffic is crazy they also don't know where they're going sorry new yorkers get your stuff together <laughs> go home new york is awesome in summertime we go to hurricane season miami so they're gonna all leave anyway because they have no idea how miami is when it rains it's not nice I have to say this really annoys me <laughs> but what i figured you just have to be gentle and just like slightly push it and let it like run before it was easier i'm not going to lie just take your time i don't like go fast because then things goes everywhere and you don't want to put placenta serum inside of it or any serum at this point because i think they all change to this you don't want to like put it to your eye <laughs> that not good let's finish this plan on their mind so i can open the glica which is somewhere in the bathroom i didn't have the feel like i needed i don't know what's going on i've been doing so many face masks i just felt like my skin didn't need any extra tightening but I feel it's good to finish it. Guys, I have to say, I purchased second BioKiss. I do see the benefit of this product. It's My lips feel really good. The only problem is it's way too expensive. It's a joke. The price is a joke. And the packaging, every time I drop it, and I, I keep dropping it for some reason because it's made of porcelain, and you see this one is totally destroyed <laughs> i even cut myself with it once and the plastic the top is cracked all over so they need to change the packaging so i checked the weather and it appears like it will rain on my day off which is wednesday which means i will be able to go to the pool but i have manicure scheduled at five because this is getting too long again so I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Three weeks is too much. I need to go over two. But I needed to get there. So I'm kind of upset. Anyway, I'm all over the place. The reason I'm mentioning it is because I can use uh, this discoloration defense serum from Skin Ceutical on this location here. And as well, I had some breakouts here. So there's a little bit of discoloration there. And I will just like massage it to the area and let it do its thing. Because I probably won't make it to the pool, which is very sad. Very sad. And I will use my Splendor there, mine. Splendid. <laughs> my Splendid cream. Once this thing soaks to the skin. I'm going to take a bath now. Let's do it. But first, I will do some dry brushing because that's what we have to do. Right, ladies? It's, it's a job. <laughs> okay, guys, 